Good evening folks and welcome to a special vlog I'm doing today. I am actually doing it for, I'm not doing it for anybody because it's not promoted or sponsored or nothing like that, but I'm doing it for a company that I have a lot of um, trust in and it's a company called alljigsawpuzzles.co.uk as you can see from the bottom here. And basically what they are, they are a UK based firm and they do their own jigsaw puzzles and they do also jigsaw puzzle accessories etc etc. And the reason I like them so much is one, they're a UK based business, they're not a major corporation like Ravensburger or somewhere like that, you know, or Amazon or whatever. And they are based down in Devon and their quality of jigsaws is fantastic. I've had a few off them now, but I've just actually today received six new jigsaws. Now, like I said, I'm not sponsored. I'm not, um, I, they don't send me the jigsaws, I've paid for these jigsaws. So, you know, don't think that I'm doing this just because I've been asked to. Now, the first one, I'm, I'm, I had a jigsaw a while ago called Chaos at the Aquarium, and uh, I did it and posted it on my vlog, and I had a couple of nice comments off it, and I just wanted to show you the kind of quality that you're looking at. Now, this is the first one, and it's another Chaos one, it's number 18, it's called Chaos at the North Pole, and as you can see, it's got like a cartoon image of all weird and wonderful things. They're all to do with Christmas, by the way, as you can tell. You've got Santa there coming down in his sleigh. Look, you've got polar bears. You've got the Titanic, which I think is hilarious. And they're good quality. I'll just show you the boxes. There's the box. And if you open them up, <clears throat> what you get is what you can see there, which is a bag full of pieces. The quality of the pieces is fantastic. They're all, they're all sealed in a bag. Excuse me, I've just had a fly in my throat. They're all sealed nice, they're all good quality and all nice thick pieces, uh, real good jigsaws to do. That's the first one, eh? that's called Chaos at the North Pole. The second one is another Chaos one and this one's called Chaos, at, uh, sorry, Christmas at Chaos Farm. And again, it's another Christmas one as you can see, as you can see from the picture, look. Another bit of a nutty scene where you've got Santa and all that sort of stuff and you've got all sorts going on there, you've got people skiing and you've got a snowman and... Again, the nice, nice jigsaws, good, good images as well. What I like about them is the artist that does them is, Rick, I think he's called Ricardo Galvao, and he does all these chaos jigsaws. And there's loads in the series, and I'd love to own all of them, and I think I will at some point. And the third one, which is going to be a, a, a nightmare to do, but I'm looking forward to doing it, is called Chaos at Santa's Grotto. That was the third one. And as you can see, like I say, the quality of the boxes is really good as well. You know, it's not your cheap plastic, you know, it's not your cheap stuff like that. And they are committed as well to cutting down their, um, what do you call it? Uh, I can't think what it is. You know, the thing where basically they are basically making all the products sustainable. They're also, they put a little thing on here that basically says once you've completed the jigsaw, if you want to give it to somebody else, let them do it. Um, obviously, uh, the, the materials that are inside as well, because they're not wrapped up in plastic, you don't have to worry about single-use plastic that's all over them. They actually come open like that. Now, some people might say, yeah, but I prefer them being wrapped. I can understand why they're not doing that, because, like I say, we've all got to do our bit for the planet, and all Jigsaw Puzzles are obviously one of the companies that's saying, look, yeah, we can do our bit, and this is what we can do. Now, the other jigsaws I've got are um, a set called The Decades. Now, I've already got the 60s and 70s. And what I was waiting to come out was the 80s, because I thought they were going to stop there, 60s, 70s, 80s. Well, the three arrived today. Again, the all jigsaw puzzles, all the same company. And this one has everything to do with the 80s. So, as you can see there, you've got Richard Gere, you've got a vinyl, you've got a cassette recorder, you've got a Rubik's Cube. You've got Pierre's Anton, which I was dead chuffed about because he's one of my favourite fantasy authors. You've got Barbie dolls, you've got a cassette there, a cassette. <laughs> and nobody knows the joy of trying to wind a cassette on when it's snapped and you've got to use a pencil. That was the 80s one. Then I had the follow on to it, which is the 90s. These are all 1,000 piece jigsaws, by the way, cracking quality. These, I don't know so much because the 90s wasn't really my era. I was working at this point, so... You know, you're talking from when I was, what, 70, I was 18 to 28, so I had a lot going on in my life. But here, across the top, you'll see this when I do the jigsaws, because I'll be doing them and then you'll be able to see them on my vlog. These are all the spy Girls as dolls, which, my opinion, they would have been better off staying that way, but there we go. Uh, you've also got like a HMV uh, DVD, uh, DVD video and DVD thing there. 
Uh, you've got different things to do with it. That's when the obviously when the CD as in there, CD look CDs. So that was the 90s, and then the follow-on, which is the 2000s. And as you can see from this 2000s here, you've got all sorts of stuff. You've got Barack Obama. You've got I don't know what that is actually. It looks like oh well, it's a BlackBerry phone. It's a BlackBerry phone. Flippy neck. And obviously it's when smartphones came in a lot more. Backstreet Boys album there, back in black. You've also got the Millennium Dome at the top. So that's the sixth one. And like I say, all of them are in brilliant quality boxes. They really are. Now, like I said, all jigsaw puzzles, the reason I wanted to do this vlog is because they are a company that, you know, don't exactly advertise all over TV. You know, they haven't got the... Um, they don't do all that sort of stuff. The word of mouth is how they do their sales. And if I'm happy with the product, I will do a promotional video to go with it. Uh, and coming up to go with the promotion, I've actually got some pictures, which I'll be showing you in a minute, of the front of the boxes, so you can see them in a bit more detail. But like I say, the company's called allgigsaws.co.uk, as you can see across the bottom here. And if you click on the link uh, that's just below my um, vlog at the moment, you will be able to be taken straight to their page and you can have a look at the fantastic array of jigsaws, puzzles and accessories that they've got. They've got 500 piece jigsaws, they've got 300 piece jigsaws, they've even got some 1000 piece jigsaws, they've got all sorts. Can you believe that? My microphone has just fell over while I'm doing a vlog. That's a first, it's never done that before. I won't. It shows it's live, doesn't it? Anyway, uh, but yeah, so go on to alljigsawpuzzles.co.uk, see what you think. You can't, you won't be disappointed, trust me. I'd give them a good 9 out of 10. Easy, 9 out of 10.